this is Stampy and welcome back to my let's play on Stardew Valley. And oh, I leveled up! I leveled up my combat. So now I have extra five hit points, which is very good. And I can now make a sturdy ring. I still don't know how to put clothes on. I should have looked that up. <laughs> and whoa, how much did I get for, for farming? I got 200 gold from just five green beans. And I'm going to get even more beans in the future as well. That's good. Uh, I got a little bit of money from a parsnip as well. Uh, a bit of money from some of the stuff I foraged. Uh, a little bit for the mining. And yeah, if you saw the last episode, you'll know what it was that I gathered and didn't gather. So right then, this is literally the, the next day on from then. And I really want to go back to the community center. There's the the Luminos or Luminos or the Dancing Apples. The Dancing Apples are there and I can now read the language of their scrolls. And they seem to really be taking hold in the community center. So I want to go there. I need to water my plots, maybe plant some new things. And I want to make some more friends as well. I kind of made a bit of a friend in the last episode. I gave someone some flowers and yes, it's raining. <laughs> I love it when it's raining because it means I don't need to bother watering the plants at all. Actually, have these, um, have these here grown. If these have grown, then that's going to be great. These have grown! Oh, what a fantastic start to the day. I can go and, uh, sell all of this kale. I should probably go and buy some new seeds. I won't go and plant them straight away. I want to go and, uh, get on with my, my list of, uh, of other tarts. Otherwise, I'm never going to do it. So let's go and throw the kale in there. Oh yeah, I also got a, uh, a dwarf scroll. Dwarf scroll four which I need to take to the museum, so I can go and uh, hopefully do that today as well. But what a joyous start to the to the day then. <laughs> right then. Oh, actually, can I afford... the? Uh, no, the upgrades were 2,000 gold, not 1,000, weren't they, I believe. So I can't afford that. Like, everything just revolves around me needing more money. It's also Pam's birthday today, and I don't know... I don't really know who Pam is very well, so <laughs> um, if I run into someone called Pam, I will go and give her some of the flowers that I'm going to be carrying around with me. If not, then I won't. Uh, it's like, oh, is this like an actual place? Open from 9am to 8pm. Is that, I wonder what that place is. I thought that was someone's home. You see, unless it is a home and they just have like opening times, which is a, <laughs> a little bit bizarre. What about the uh, the museum then? Because I should probably stop off here. Are you open? Uh, 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. Oh, wait. Seeing as uh, I'm right here, I might as well go and wait around. Are there any berries or anything that I can, I can cover up while I'm waiting around here? It doesn't look like there is, but there's only like a little second for, for me to, to wait anyway, so... I'll do a little loop around the, the outside here, and then I'll get back, and now it's open. <laughs> in some ways, it's good the way time goes so fast, and in other ways, it isn't. So, right then, I don't need to talk to him. All I need to, to do is go and... Actually, no, I do, do, I, need, I do need to talk to him, don't I? And then I get to choose where it goes, I believe. Also, I think, doesn't he have the key to the sewer as well? Anyway, let's uh, donate to the, the museum first, my, my scroll. And I want it to be placed here. I'm just spreading things out uh, around the area. Right, okay, jolly good. That's that placed in the, the museum. It says like he would tell me more about it, but he doesn't really. It doesn't seem like you have anything to donate to the museum. Better get out there and do some treasure hunting, huh? Because I think apparently there was like a key to the sewer that he had. Do you reckon it's just lying around here somewhere? What's this here? Oh, is that like, I think it's just like a stool to get higher up books. Because there was two kids by the sewer and they were talking about it. Uh, a yellowish scroll of parchment filled with dwarven script. Uh, this one's tied with a golden chain. You're welcome, museum. You're welcome. I can't see a key anywhere around here, though. I wonder if maybe if I get... There's a missing book. Maybe if I get the missing book. Anything written down here? Let's talk to him again. Nope. Nothing to donate. Okay. Yep, I guess I'm going to have to track down that sewer key at some point. But for now, let's let's go to the community center then, because that's one of like the, the big main things I need to do. Actually, you know what? Let's stop off at that little um that little caravan place, because that should be open, whatever that is now. And I don't think I've been in there yet. And one of my very, very, very first missions, maybe my first ever, was to, to introduce myself to everyone. But there's still people in town I have never met before. And it was this Pam! It's Pam! Happy birthday, Pam! Ah, I had one too many caramel porters at the saloon last night. Go away. It's your birthday, though. I got you flowers. Oh, is it my birthday today? I guess it is. Thanks. This is nice. Oh, well, that might be nice, but you don't seem very nice. Not very friendly at all by the looks of things. I can't even talk to her anymore. 
Like, it literally won't let me talk to her. Well, I feel like I've wasted flowers on her. She didn't even know it was her birthday. She didn't appreciate it. Well, you know what? Maybe she's a little bit lonely and maybe she needed some flowers to, to cheer herself up because, yeah, she she didn't seem to be the the jolliest of, uh, of people here. Anyway, let's go and buy some more stuff. Uh, let's get tulip plant. Takes six days to produce a colourful flower. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go and get five of them. They're, they're not too expensive. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, we can go and uh, get some of them growing. How am I doing with my task to meet everyone then? Four people. There's four people hiding somewhere around the, the town here. I haven't been down the beach very much recently, so there could be some some more people down around the, the beach. What's the, this place here? Look, I've been looking at this place for a while. And it's all like corded off. There's got to be something hidden in here, surely. Surely this isn't just grass. Is there nothing hidden in there? I was certain there was going to be something hidden in that place there because it just seemed so like obviously cornered off. And look at the play area. Can I play on anything? Can I can I go up like the the climbing wall and down the slide? Oh, it won't let me play. What's the point in having a play area if you can't even play in it? <laughs> I can though. Go and gather these uh, these berries. I'm mainly I'm selling a few of them just because I'm getting so many of them, but I'm mainly uh, keeping them for for me uh, just to keep my energy nicely up. Especially if I'm going down in the the mines and stuff, it's very helpful. I keep I keep trying to find like coal in the ground and stuff as if it's just going to be lying around on the the floor like that. But anyway, let's go into the um the, the community center then and let's see if we can find any of the I think it is luminous. I might be pronouncing that wrong. Let me let me know if I am. So I should be able to read the the scrolls. Are there? Any more scrolls? So this is the one I found before. Oh, <laughs> there he goes, <laughs> running away. Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, are these things that I need to deliver? Ah! Oh, I, okay, I really should have looked at this before. So this is the this is the spring foraging bundle, or the exotic one. Okay, that one seems a little bit far off. Stone, a full uh, summer one, winter construction bundle. Oh, I won't be able to do that. Two stacks of 19. I might actually be able to do that. What about the spring one? So I need a daffodil. Oh, this is this is really easy. What, what's what's that thing there? Is that like a turnip or something? Or a parsnip? I think I need, I think that's a leek, maybe a parsnip, a daffodil, and then one of those other flowers. Okay, I need to do that. And then I need two stacks of wood. So basically 200 wood, 100 stone, and 10 of like, that. I think it's called like hard stone or hardwood or like strong wood or tough wood or something along those lines right i guess these are a bunch of goals i might be able to do some of this stuff i didn't expect to be able to do any of this stuff <laughs> right so i need to go and pick up those flowers at the foot oh that food i sold it i i had i could have done it why didn't i look sooner sorry if you've been shouting at me in the comments and i and i didn't see about <laughs> selling all of this stuff. Oh, that's driven me crazy. Right, I might be able to do that construction one though. And if I can't, I might be able to like just gather the stuff now to be able to, to do it. I'm, I'm keeping an eye out for those other flowers. The stuff I need to grow, I need to grow. There's not really much I can do about that. I guess apart from put fertilizer down in the hope that it's going to grow quicker. Actually, I don't think it does make it grow quicker. I think it just grows better, I guess. Uh, right, so I got the wood. I got the wood. I got more than enough wood. And then I need... Ah, oh, I need more hardwood. A special kind of wood with superior strength and beauty. I've only got one. Where did I get the hardwood from? I need to find out where I got the hardwood from. The stone won't be a problem. I can gather that anyway. Okay, so I need to find where to get. Is it like, are there like different trees that I gather it from? That wouldn't be a, a ridiculous thing to, to be the case, would it? Maybe there's a special type of tree I need to get it from. I mean, all of these trees look pretty much the same, to be fair, though. It's such a mess, isn't it? It's such a mess, this farm! <laughs> I can hardly walk through it because of all of the stuff that's in the, the way. I'll clear it out when I need to, to end up expanding it. That's exciting, though. That's like an exciting mission for, for me to, to complete in the, the future. Anyway, let's go and uh, plant all of my lovely flowers. A, a really good time to, to plant them, seeing as... um. Yeah, seeing as I don't need to, to water them or anything right away. And then I guess we should go back to the, the mine might be a, a good thing to, to do for, for today. I'll keep these. Well, let's put one of these daffodils. Let's leave one of the daffodils there so I make sure I don't accidentally throw that away. And then when I get the other type of flower as well, I think there might have been more flowers up this path here. I don't think I ever properly explored up this way. I think I started going this way one time and then... 
you know me, I got distracted and, and wandered off somewhere else and did something else. So let's go this way. And oh, there are loads and loads of berries here. So I will definitely go and uh, gather up a, a whole bunch of these, seeing as they're, they're here. But it's, I really need to work out how to get that hardwood because that's the only thing that I don't have. And I just want to put it in there to find out what it's going to be. I mean, the spring thing. Oh, that just leads around to here. Oh, this is just a really fast way to get up this way. Oh, that's really handy. I might go and try and give a... um. Give some more flowers to the, the guy who lives in the, the tent. I gave him some flowers yesterday, and then I tried to give him more flowers, and it's like, you've already given him flowers today. Calm down. He can't... <laughs> he hasn't got room for any more flowers. So let's see if I can give him some more flowers, because he said he won't trust me until I've given him some more presents. So there we go. Oh, you're giving him two gifts for this week. That's enough. That's enough, friends. Can I go... Can I go inside his tent? Oh, of course, a bit. It's a bit... Oh, is that hardwood? Is that like a giant pile of hardwood? Can I just, like, steal his hardwood? No, it won't let me steal his hardwood. <laughs> That's not a good way to make friends. Is it like, so maybe these trees? Is, it won't even let me cut them down. I guess I'd be kind of stealing his trees a little bit. I wonder if it's going to open up these. Or maybe these are going to be teleportation points that it's going to be opened up once I've completed those goals. That might be uh, quite a, a nice reward for, for being able to, to do that. Anyway. I've wasted a, a lot of time today. Actually, I don't think I've wasted time. I've, I've discovered a lot of very valuable information. So that has been extremely handy. But let's keep going down here because it started to, to really open up. There's a room with a bunch of enemies in. And I do need to face these enemies because I have challenges to uh, in the Adventurers Guild to kill like certain amounts of these enemies. So I really do need to, to try and start taking out a, a decent amount of them. Like I think it's like a thousand slimes or something I need to, to take out. So <laughs> like I'm not going to go real out of my way to do it like it's just gonna happen anyway like with me going mining all the the same it's probably just gonna keep happening anyway and whoa speedy little bug flying right through me I think I do need to, to take these guys out as well so let's go and see if I can take up this guy and then I need to work out what I can craft of all of this stuff there's like a bunch of loot that they they keep dropping and I don't know I don't know what I can do but I don't know should I just be selling it should I not sell it because there's something good that I need to, to craft with it these guys are really going after me now though <laughs> they're doing a decent amount of damage as well they kind of fly through me a little bit don't they let's let's get out of here there's there's too many of them just run I just need to run I just need to run oh, I got a cave camera Carrot. I got myself a cave carrot. There was a place that I actually found that was selling cave carrots, but I just want to get down to this next level. Oh no! Oh, they're surrounding me. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Go down. Go down. Go down. Okay, so eating food. Does that put my health up at all? Let's eat this up. I don't think it puts my health. Oh no! It put my health up a tiny bit. A tiny, tiny little bit. So there is the, um, the, the hospital or the, the doctors, I'm not exactly sure what it is, right next to the, the shop. And they do sell like, not potions, I guess like medicine uh, as well. So maybe I should uh, I should think about grabbing some of that stuff before I come down. And then those little things that you saw like poking out of the, the ground, I need to, to take out a, a certain amount of, uh, of those guys as well. Does it get darker down here when it gets like later outside? It seems to just suddenly get darker. I don't know if that's just because I'm under the cave or because it's getting like darker in the day. You'd think that it shouldn't really matter too much. It shouldn't really affect anything. Same as like, I'm deep down in this cave anyway. But these guys poking up. These guys are a pain. This guy's really after me. Can I, can I, I think I need to like dodge him and then take him out. Oh, I got some sneakers from him though. That's good. <laughs> I should probably think about heading back to the surface now though. Because yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting a little bit beat up about this. Let's see if I can take out one more of these little guys. Because these seem to have good stuff. It looks like they can only appear on this soft ground here though. So if I do need to escape them, I can just get to the, the harder ground. But there we go. There is a another one taken out. It wasn't the, the biggest loot that I was able to, to get ever. But seeing as I need... I seem to need money more than I need the ores. I wonder if it would be worth selling some of, like, the copper in that. I don't know. Maybe that's a really bad idea. Because I am going to, to need to, to have it at some point in the, the future. But for right now, it seems like I need money more than anything else. So I don't know if it's going to be, I don't, I don't know if it would be a good idea. I might sell one of my copper ingots just to see how much it gives me, like how much uh, money it gives me. Because if it's a decent amount, that might actually be a, a pretty smart thing for, for me to do now. And then kind of worry about gathering up more of the, the, the ores and stuff a, a little bit uh, later on in the, the future. So right then, let's uh, go back to the, the farm now.
Uh, it's too late to, to really buy anything else. So how long do I have left of spring? It's not it's not that long left. There is flower dance, which I have to, uh, to, to look forward to. And Shane's birthday is coming up. I mean, people's birthday might be a really great way for me to, to make sure I meet people. Because if I really try to track them down on their birthdays, then, you know, eventually it's going to be someone's birthday at every point in the, the, in the year. So eventually I will hopefully be able to, to track down everyone's stuff. I got a cave carrot though. That's quite exciting. Let's go and, uh, let's go and sell the, the cave carrot then. I'll sell a few of these and I'll keep hold of the, the rest. I'll keep hold of the, the flowers and let's go and get one of the, uh, actually I can sell sell you as well the earth crystal and a, a geode as well oh yeah the blacksmith needs to i think i got another one of them let's go to the the blacksmith in the the morning where's there's where's my other geode here we go here's my other geode there so let's go and grab that so i got that on me uh, as well let's go and take out one of the 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 copper bars i guess we're we'll throw the the sneakers in here for now seeing as i still don't know how to put them on my feet because i am the world's biggest noob and let's see how much we get for this copper ore but there might be something good in this geode as well which is something i'm looking forward to and seeing as i have a huge amount of energy i'm just going to go and waste it all down now clearing out this area because i do want to start extending the the farm soon at least by summer i want to have my farm extended so let's go and start clearing out some room so i'll be able to, to build it across but i'm going to cut ahead and to it's the the next morning okay it's now the the next morning i did all of my plant watering done because i'm sure you've you've already seen enough of me watering the the same plants again and again and again i haven't got my sprinklers yet i really need to get some iron to do that i could buy some iron to get some sprinklers not a bad idea stampy good idea anyway uh jody sent me a message i have a request for you i need fresh cauliflower for a recipe i want to make could you bring me one uh maybe I don't know if I've even seen to plant that. What's this down here? Can I grab, gather, gather this up? Do I need to use a scythe to gather this up? I don't know what that is. Anyway, my flowers have grown. These grew really, really fast, didn't they? Uh, so that's good. Uh, are, are these like, is this like a special one here? There's blue one, blue ones, and blue. Do I just eat them? I just eat the flowers <laughs> like a goat or something. Let's uh, let's just go and sell these four for now. We go and throw them away in there. So I'm gonna go to the the, the museum in a second i need to go and get some uh i need to go and get a, a cauliflower then so i guess i could go and see if there's some cauliflower seeds that i could get i nearly nearly have enough money to be able to upgrade my tools i need 2000 but i always need 2000 but i don't quite have enough yet but i will do soon uh, once my next harvest of beans is uh, is here i should be uh, i should have enough to, to do that let's go check the calendar quick uh nothing of note today oh shesh sure, your birthday tomorrow shane uh, don't you have work to do? Why is everyone so grumpy when it's nearly their birthdays? It's ridiculous. Let's go and see if we can get any, um, any cauliflower seeds from in here. I've got to wait another 10 minutes. And now it's open. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, just so we can get that, get that started growing. Uh, I don't think there's a time limit for that. There we go, cauliflower seeds. Let's just go and get five of them then. There we go. I now have nowhere near enough money to, to get what I need to, to get. But I'll get it all back eventually. I will do eventually. And I'm supporting my local shop uh, as well, which is uh, very uh, important. So... Right then, let's go. Let's go straight down to the the museum first. We can go and get everything uh, else growing a, a little bit later on, uh, so I can be able to get the the cauliflower seeds. How long do they they take to grow cauliflower seeds? Twelve days to produce. Oh, I, I spring my end. I don't know if they're gonna go because once spring ends, I think they all die. Hopefully that doesn't happen. I need to I need to make sure I time that right because that that could be a disaster. Uh, processed geodes. Do I need to pay? Of course I need, I need to pay very, I need to pay to breathe in this town. Right, place your geodes on my anvil and then I'll give them a whack. All right, I place it and he gives it a whack. <laughs> place it, oh, can I place the next one? Place it and he gives it a whack. What did I get? What is this stuff? I got sandstone very nice uh gunther can tell you more about this if you donate it to the museum i don't get to keep it uh and i need to donate this to the the museum as well i'm starting to see why the um they put the the blacksmith and then the uh, the museum are right next to each other just <laughs> so you can keep going back and forth here so uh, let's go and donate these to the the museum like once i've donated one to the the museum i guess that the rest i'll be able to to maybe keep and sell or craft something out of a new reward ah i've donated enough stuff i get a present oh this makes it feel a little bit more worthwhile collect my reward cauliflower seed 
needs. <laughs> no way! I could have not even bought. How many? Excuse me, how many? Was that like loads? I think, didn't I only buy? Was that like nine I got or something? Nine cauliflower. That's amazing. Let me go give some. Let me give some flowers to Lewis here because he loves his flowers, and I want him to become my friend. That's very nice of you. Thanks. You're welcome, Lewis. Are we? Are we friends? Is Lewis my first friend? No, not 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 quite yet. No one's no one's particularly friendly with me. Let me just give out flowers. Would you like? Would you like some flowers? I love presents. Thank you. Everyone loves presents, even when they say, "Oh no, don't get me any presents this year." I don't. All I need is to have a, a good, happy time. No, people want presents. <laughs> Everyone likes presents. <laughs> Let's just be honest about that. All right. So these cauliflowers, they take twelve days to grow, and they need to be in spring. I need to be careful here. Let me let me count how many days left of spring we have. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't think I don't think I can grow them. Cause don't because won't they die afterwards? I think I might hold on to them. Well I'm gonna I'm gonna plant one of them just in case it can grow in time. I don't wanna plant all of them because I don't wanna waste all of these cauliflower seeds, because I think that once it goes to the next season, they might die. Spring and summer might be okay. It's not like it's suddenly going to winter, but I just want to be careful. So let's, I'll plant, I'll plant two of them. Seeing as I have so many, I'm going to plant two of them here, but I want to play it safe. I don't want to go and plant too many, but I can keep the, the seeds safely away in here. Uh, and so then uh, when it gets to, to kind of the next spring, I'll be able to, to grow them. I can also go and grow, uh, grow a few more of these, um, uh, these mixed seeds as well down here and I should probably water them just so they do have at least a chance to, to grow I'm looking forward to getting my special potatoes because I spent spent a hundred gold on fertilizer so I better get some <laughs> get some really lovely potatoes at the the, the end of the, the day after this anyway I think this has been a another a pretty a successful day uh, inside of Stardew Valley seen as I have a um a bunch of, uh, of spare energy. I might as well go and waste uh, all of this uh, away going to cut things down. It's only like noon <laughs> and I feel like I've completed all of the, the things that it is that I wanted to, to complete today. I don't know whether the, the hardwood, I'm just going to like randomly get it from like special trees or something or maybe I can plant them. That's going to be my, my main point uh, of research between this episode and the, the next episode. And then also I want to get some more of the, the leaks and stuff uh, so I can go and complete all of the stuff from the, the constructor stuff. There are going to be my next uh, immediate goals uh, from here on out. Of course, if you are a Stardew Valley expert and you kind of have any suggestions or kind of want to, to gently point me in a, a direction for, for where I should go in the, the future, feel free to do that. But please, no spoilers, no telling me exactly what I should do. I want to, to bumble through and discover some stuff uh, in my own special natural way. <laughs> anyway though, that is going to be the end of this episode here. There are going to be uh, plenty more Stardew Valley episodes coming up in the... I said that really weird, didn't I? Stardew Valley episodes coming up in the, the future. As always, it's going to be the next episode and the description and the, um, the the playlist in the description if you want to go and watch them straight through that way. But for now, thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all later. Bye!